Most children are taught from an early age to respect other people's property. For the ones that grow up without learning this lesson, the Texas Penal Code has the offense of criminal mischief. The Penal Code states, a person who intentionally or knowingly damages or destroys tangible property of another commits criminal mischief. An example is throwing a rock through the window of someone's house or car. A person also commits criminal mischief when they tamper with tangible property of another and cause a pecuniary, or in other words, financial loss, or substantial inconvenience to the owner or a third person without consent. Pay attention to this last part. You don't necessarily have to cause a financial loss to have committed criminal mischief. A great example of criminal mischief, which involves tampering with tangible property which causes a substantial inconvenience to the owner, are egging a house. Dried eggs on a house or car may take paint off and cause a financial loss, but even if they don't, they are definitely a substantial inconvenience to clean. These sorts of criminal mischief offenses are C misdemeanors. Finally, a person also commits criminal mischief if they make markings, inscriptions, slogans, drawings, or paintings on tangible property of another without consent. As a side note, there's another penal code offense called graffiti which is very similar to this portion of criminal mischief. Criminal mischief is graded primarily by the cost of the damage, though there are other specifications. This graphic shows felonies of the first degree through the third degree. Pause the screencast to review the chart. This graphic shows state jail felonies on down to C misdemeanors. Now, the El Paso County Sheriff's Office is searching for a couple of teens who are accused of stealing several fire extinguishers and spraying them at the county parking lot. Investigators say smoke from the extinguishers caused emergency crews to be called out. That's when they say the teens were seen on surveillance camera running from the parking lot. If anyone has information, you are asked to call the number you see right there on your screen. Of course it's a public sidewalk. Thank you for acknowledging that I could be here. Wherever you want to set up your perimeter, I'll back up, bro. But you can't just get up, run up on people like that, bro. Okay, to be honest, all we're going to do is stand there like, where you want to be, you know? Whatever. I could stand here, bro. Yeah, yeah, fine. Gonna... What's your name and badge number, just for the record? 2561. 2561. You're professional, bro. We're going to be here. This is our crime scene here. Right now, we just had a criminal mischief, man. That's why we have it. Yes. Broken glass. That's why it. couldn't he say that yeah. seven minutes ago? Well, Okay. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. That's all we have right now. That's I appreciate right. you, brother. I appreciate you. Just letting me know, bro. I mean, it's going to be public information anyway. I just don't like the way he comes up within like inches of me, puts his hands on me. 
pushes me around like I'm not a grown ass man. It's cool if y'all have a crime scene. I didn't know. I wasn't privy to that. Yeah. So if he tells me he's going to set up some tape, that's cool. I'll yeah, move to where the tape is, bro. Record, that's why just it's your discretion. That's it, man. Yeah, that's all I came to do, bro. I just I just came to document this, bro. Right. Nothing against y'all, bro. I'm not I'm not anti-cops, bro. Right, I've had bad deals with y'all in the past, but I haven't let that shit... No. I haven't held that grudge, bro. Okay. I did for a while, bro. I did for a while. You know? So I would see you guys, and I would instantly hate y'all for no reason. But I know just one interaction with a cop, bro... You know, a lot of people, they have a bad interaction with a cop today. They get stopped months later. They already have that shit in their head. So instead of you guys coming over here like this guy, shining lights, put, you know, putting pants on people, why don't you just be respectful and courteous, bro? Because, you know, like, I'm not going to hold this shit. This, I'm done after this. I'm not even thinking about him, bro. But I'm saying, I have a bad experience with a cop. I'm someone else. They might do something stupid to y'all. Or you guys think, oh, like this guy, he's recording us. He's bothering us. So you guys get that disdain for me. But I don't have nothing against y'all, bro. I'm just here to document what's going on. And that's about it, bro. Now, we're going to go up and finish, and then that's all for now. We have that's cool, bro. That's cool. And I'm going to stay where you guys want me to stay. Yeah, as long as you're yeah. inside, we'll have your good for now. Just don't come inside, right? Thanks, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Gomez, you don't want to correct this behavior? I just literally had a three-minute conversation on how to be professional and courteous, and here he goes, bro. Putting that shit on my face. You stupid ass. None of y'all want to check him on that? None of y'all? Yeah. You're fine over there where you were. I just don't appreciate you behind me. I don't care what you appreciate. Okay. I'm telling you right now, you need to step back. That's it. I'm not asking anymore. Step back. I'm standing in a place I'm legally allowed to be. Step back. This is a sidewalk. This is the last time I'm asking you to step back, sir. Sir, right now we're trying to conduct a criminal investigation. Okay? You're interfering with that. I didn't know. Don't continue to walk off. You can record. Just record from back there, okay? Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Can you get your hands off? Keep going. Right there. Okay? I don't want you any closer than this to record, okay? Thank you. Fuck you. very important that the community speaks out to the needs of the community. Yeah, and I wanted to gauge the interest. Uh, it's worth bringing back. So uh, that, that's, an, that's another reason for this meeting. Um, are there topics that you would like to see us bring presenters on? Did you need help with anything? Do you need to cross? Alright, so we're gonna get back to what we're doing, okay? Check out this back, and I don't feel comfortable with you creeping up behind us. I'm not creeping up on you. Yes, you are, sir. I'm there's walking a, beside you. No, there's a sidewalk right here, sir. There's no need for you to come over here where I'm I standing where you. I'm legally allowed to no, be. I'm Get the fucking work. No, sir. We're trying to. I'm do standing where I'm legally allowed to be. I'm standing where I'm legally no, allowed sir. to be. No, this is no, a public sir. area. Shut your fucking mouth and get to work. 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 Yes, sir. Right there, sir. Shut the fuck up, dude. That's as far as you can go. Shut up. No, sir. That's as far as you can go. That's as far as you can go, sir. You're interfering now, sir. My partner's trying to check you. I'm in a public area yes, recording you. Yeah, but we have a scene right now, sir. We're trying to figure out it's why it's here. It's a fucking it's motorcycle. No, we're trying to figure out why it's here. We're trying to figure out why it's here. So figure it out. I can't because you're walking up behind us, sir. Just f shut up, dude. Stay away from the car. I'm walk car. Okay. This, this looks car. like a sidewalk to me. Okay, well, you also seem intoxicated, so just stay away from our scene and uh, don't 
once they leave, you can do, do whatever you want. Do I seem like a danger to myself or others? Yeah, you no. actually do. You're a liar. Okay, well, stay away from my scene. I'm standing on a public sidewalk. Okay, stay away from my scene. I'm standing on a public sidewalk. Okay, you can stand there. You're doing good, man. Don't start with your fucking lies, dude. I'm okay. That's why we need to get you old dinosaurs out. You guys are too used to lying. That's what public intoxication is for. It's for people who are dangerous to themselves or others, not just people you don't like. No. You've been drinking. I'm not denying that. What I'm okay. saying is I'm not a danger to myself or others. That's well, what the legislature in Austin intended. Well, you continue to uh, move forward when I ask you to stop. So, But you're doing good now. So we're I'm on a public sidewalk where I'm allowed to move. Unless it's a crime scene, where it is. It's a There's crime no scene. crime scene tape, dude. You have, you have no idea what's going on. So just relax. You're doing fine. Do whatever you want to do, man. As long yeah, as but don't you. start threatening me with crimes as long I haven't as long committed. As you do whatever you're doing, that's fine. Just stay away from the crime scene. I'm not. See that? That's why we need to get you old dinosaurs out. Okay. See how, see what you're doing? You're posturing. You're intimidating me. I'm trying to move around the sidewalk. <sighs> can I just freely move without you intimidating sure, you me? you can go that way if you'd like. And I can come back, right? Sure. It's an open sidewalk. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. So don't be, you know, doing your thing. Okay, I'm, I'm just doing what I do. You do I, what you I, do. I don't want you like trying to like move in on me. Okay, all right. All right. Okay. I'm still doing it. Okay. Just walking with you, brother. See, what, that's what I'm talking about. You're trying to make something out of nothing. I'm not making anything out of anything. You're trying to start something. No. And here's, see, hey, you're the supervisor. You got to stop him. That's a, against policy right there. What he's, hey, I'm talking to you, Sergeant. Look at what he's doing. I don't know what he's doing. That flashlight thing, that man right there. Talk to him. He just did that shit on purpose. I have no idea what you're talking about. You're a fucking liar. Okay. That's the second time you just lied to me. Okay. What's your name, Sergeant? Sergeant Davis. And your badge? 2303. All right. Not that you'll remember. No, my camera will. Okay. When do you retire? Who knows, man? Who knows? Hopefully soon enough. Okay. Moving on up, little by little. Are we up? All right. Well, let's book it. Sir, enjoy the rest of your day. I'm sure that was laughing at me, not with me. Wherever you want to set up your perimeter, I'll back up, bro. But you can't just get up, run up on people like that, bro. I could stand here, bro. Yeah, yeah, fine. What's your name and badge number, just for the record? 2561. You're professional, bro. We're going to be here. This is our crime scene here. Right now, we just had a criminal mischief, man. That's why we have yes. broken glass. That's why it. couldn't he say that yeah. seven minutes ago? Well, I'm letting you know, man. Okay. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. We're just going to bring the tape set up here. And that's all we have right now. That's I appreciate right. you, brother. I appreciate you. Just letting me know, bro. I mean, it's going to be public information anyway. I just don't like the way he comes up within, like, inches of me, puts his hands on me, pushes me around like I'm not a grown-ass man. It's cool if y'all have a crime scene. I didn't know. I was impervious to that. Yeah. So if he tells me he's going to set up some tape, that's cool. I'll yeah, move to where the tape is, bro. Record, that's just, just it's record your discretion. That's it, man. Yeah, that's all I came to do, bro. I just I just came to document this, bro. Right. Nothing against y'all, bro. I'm not I'm not anti-cops, bro. Right, I've had bad deals with y'all in the past, but I haven't let that shit... I haven't held that grudge, bro. Okay. I did for a while, bro. I did for a while. You know? So I would see you guys, and I would instantly hate y'all for no reason. But I know just one interaction with a cop, bro... 
Yeah. You know, a lot of people, they have a bad interaction with a cop today. They get stopped months later. They already have that shit in their head. So instead of you guys coming over here like this guy, shining lights, put, you know, putting hands on people, why don't you just be respectful and courteous, bro? Because, you know, like, I'm not going to hold this shit. This, I'm done after this. I'm not even thinking about him, bro. But I'm saying, I have a bad experience with a cop. I'm someone else. They might do something stupid to y'all. Or you guys think, oh, like this guy, he's recording us. He's bothering us. So you guys get that disdain for me. But I don't have nothing against y'all, bro. I'm just here to document what's going on. And that's about it, bro. Uh, we're doing the weapon finish, and then that's all for now. We have that's cool, brother. That's, sure that's cool. Right and I'm going to stay where you guys want me to stay. Yeah, as long as you're yeah. inside, we'll have your good for now. Just don't come inside, right? Thanks, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Gomez, you don't want to correct this behavior? I just literally had a three-minute conversation on how to be professional and courteous, and here he goes, bro. Putting that shit on my face. You stupid ass. None of y'all want to check him on that? None of y'all? Perez, you don't want to check him? Nah, it's cool that he could do that to me. It's cool he could shine that shit in my face. Blind the fucking camera. You know, I'm trying to get this. He's blocking what I'm trying to document, y'all. That's prior restraint. Idiot, check it up. Check it up, yeah, make that stupid face, bro. Check it out. You can't blind the camera, bro. This is press. This is press, you fucking Momo. So I just came to record what I now know is a criminal mischief call. And that's all the guy had to say, bro. That's all he had to say. You know, we got this call. We're going to block off this little scene. Blah, blah, blah. Stand right there. Boom. I'm over here. That's all. But now he's got to open his little mouth. Put his hands on people. Blind motherfuckers and shit. All right, so we had a criminal mischief call here at the Walgreens in, at 300 South Oregon in downtown El Paso. Got a couple Metro cops, a couple bike cops on the scene. I pulled, I came up on them and asked them what had happened. They immediately tried to push me up to across the street. I'm still on this side of the street, how about that? <laughs> how about that? And they tried to push me across the street. You know, he pushed me to this little that's how far I am from him right now. So I'm, you know, I'm nowhere near their scene. They want to put tape, they could do that. This guy, bro. It's fucking frozen. Look at him. You scared or something, bro? It's got that look in his eyes, yo. A terrorizer right here. Yeah, blah blah, fucking blah. Shut the fuck up. Behind the behind the tape, right? My name is Officer Franco, ID number 1393. I've been called you up again. Oh, I remember you, bro. Yeah, okay. Usted se portó chida, bro. Yeah, con el Pérez. Usted se portó chida, bro. Is this good, Franco? Right here? Yeah. I'm going to close up to the... Nah, it's fine. We'll tell him. Alright, go for it. There's this guy right here, y'all. Mr. Jittery. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Appreciate your help. Have a good day, sir. You too, bro. You too. Don't take it out on the next person, bro. Keep it with me. Keep that hate with me. Remember me. So as you see, y'all, they blocked this shit out. Set up a pretty big perimeter. So he said, I'm going to go across the street and get a better shot over there.
All right, y'all, here it is. So I threw a rock through the glass. Shattered the glass right there. And... Oh, that's pretty fucked up. So someone either tried to or broke into this Walgreens here. We got officers now taking pictures of the crime scene. There's broken glass at the front of the store, at the door. There's a rock. So they pretty much got this scene handled, yeah. Not gonna stay here too much longer. Just wanna get a couple shots for y'all. See how these guys handle themselves. I think our, our managers or people people here at the store. But, but yeah, y'all look they put the tape up. I set up the little crime scene. They should have done it as soon as they got here, bro. You know, they don't want nobody contaminating the crime scene. You know? But I didn't know that when I got here, bro. And he tried to push me across the street. Like, like what, bro? Like, who are you to push me across the street? And look what they set up this shit anyway, bro. Could literally stand on the other side right there and re fucking record. So, you know, it's just a little power trip. They do have to set up their scene. Something did happen here. I'm not trying to interfere with them. Just here to record, bro. Hey, you be good, Franco. Y'all be good, bro. Gomez. Nah, y'all be good, bro. Hey, you look good, bro. You really, hey, you make you guys look good, bro. Just people like him, bro. Just check him. You know, nothing official. Just make sure he knows, bro. You know, we're not here to do anything to y'all, interfere or nothing. Just be respectful like you, bro. All right, bro. You too, Franco. Have a good one, bro. All right, y'all. See? We treat them how we get treated, bro. They treat us with respect. We treat them with respect. But you want to come put your hands on me, order me around like I'm a fucking dog. That's where I have a fucking problem, y'all. But, yeah, we out.